What I love about hostels is that you, you get to, to, to meet a lot of people. I, I love traveling alone and I've, I've been traveling alone a long time. Last year I've been traveling the whole year in South, uh, South America, from Mexico to Argentina. I've done every country and I've, me I've met so many people. You can learn a lot from them and learn a lot about yourself too. First time I left uh, with my backpack alone was for nine months. So uh, I didn't know what to, what to expect. And actually I met a lot of people and it was great. I had a great time. And nine months later, uh, I thought it was a better idea to, to go alone than with friends. It was way better. Why? Because you learn much about yourself when you're with people that you know. And uh, you're always kind of the, the same person. When you go in hostels, you can be a new person every day. I mean every day, every three days, every week. And being this new person every time makes you find yourself better. I think you, if you stay in, in your, you stay in your, in your world, uh, in your city, and with all the same people around you, the same family, the same, I, I don't think you should forget about your family or your friends. They're really important people and you should stay in contact if you're backpacking. But if you always stay in this world and don't get to know other people from other places, you, you will never evolve uh, in your head. I met a lot of different persons with their own culture and they brought me a lot from, from what they had. Um, I have many, exp <laughs> many uh, experiences in backpacking and, and stories. I had a really one story, a really good story, a backpacker story. Uh, I, was, I was backpacking in Mexico and I met this girl from, from Denmark. She was traveling with her sister. And we just saw each other one day and uh, we had such a blast. We got to hang out on Facebook and uh, talk together. And uh, actually it lasted a little bit longer than I thought. Uh, that means two years. <laughs> and two years later, we were we, we, we still chatting together on, on Facebook. And then she came to Paris, uh, to Paris with uh, her sister. And uh, she met my friends and, and all, all that. And then I met her again in Colombia one year later. And then I met her again in Argentina. And then she came again to Paris and I'm soon going to Denmark. So she's one of my best friends. And uh, it's a great story because that's, that's a real friend I made. And it's not someone I met and I'm not going to see anymore. And you get to, to, do, to, get to, to know real friends and real good people for you. And this is great. So if you're 20 and you go to Europe backpacking and you say I want to go to stay in hotels, I'll say you, you're silly <laughs> because you'll be alone and you will meet nobody and, and it will be more expensive and the price is not something you should consider because it's priceless to be in, in hostels and even if you have to, to stay and sleep in a bed with eight people in the same room, that's how you meet people and then uh, when you go to bed you're like, oh, where are you from? And then starts a conversation, maybe it's going to change your life. Okay, if it's the first time you're backpacking and if you're scared, you shouldn't because I met a lot of girls, they were 18 or something and they were back backpacking alone. And these people, I, I tell you, you have to be careful but as much as in your city. It's the same thing, some places you, you don't go, some places you can go. But hostels are safe and uh, you meet a lot of people and you, you get to hang out with them. And it's great to discover a lot of things. You can talk about your country, about other countries, about what you do, share a lot of things. And uh, you shouldn't be scared at all. I always have my backpack and another, ba another bag, and that's all. I, ha I have all my life in my backpack, and that's all. That's all I need. I think backpacking is not an option. It's, it's a need, because when you travel, you, you get to find yourself. That's how I find myself, so go backpacking and go find yourself. I just want to talk to you about this book. This is a book I've been, um, I've been carrying while I was traveling and uh, asked people to write something in it, but not about me, about themselves and their model language and uh, what, why they travel and uh, why, what is their life philosophy? Some of them are really short and some of them are really long. Some of them are two pages. And uh, I met so many great people and you're gonna meet so many great people while backpacking. And uh, like this guy doing Chile to Alaska in a small car, Volkswagen. 
and crazy other guys. And I wish you have one too like that and you can come back to your house and say, I've met all these people and they've brought me so many stuff. So that's about my book.